Harry Belafonte. Harry Belafonte was an American singer, activist, and actor, as arguably the most successful Caribbean American pop star. He popularized Jamaican mento folk songs, which was marketed as Tin Magonian Calypso musical style with an international audience in the 1950s. His breakthrough album, Calypso 1956, was the first million selling LP by a single artist. He was born in March 1, 1927, New York City, United States. He died on April 25, 2023. Belafonte died from heart failure at his home on the Upper West Side of Manhattan at the age of 96. Caspar R. Taylor Jr. Caspar R. Taylor Jr. was an American politician who served as a speaker of the Maryland House of Delegates from 1994 to 2003 amongst the longest speakers in years in Maryland history. He also represented districts 1C and 2A in the House of Delegates from 1975 to 2003. He was born in December 19, 1934, Forstburg, Maryland, United States. Taylor died at his home in Cumberland, Maryland on April 24, 2023 at the age of 88. Ken Ports. Ken Ports was an American World War II veteran who was awarded the USS Arizona BB-39 when it was attacked on December 7, 1941. Prior to his death, Ports was one of two known remaining members of the Arizona crew at the time of the attack. He was born in April 15, 1921. Honey Illinois, U.S. Ports died on April 21, 2023, at the age of 102. Willie McCarter Willie McCarter was an American basketball player. He was a 6.3. He played at Drake University, averaging 19.9 ppg in three seasons. He was drafted by the Los Angeles Lakers with the 12th pick in the 1969 NBA draft and played three seasons with the Lakers and Portland Trail Blazers. He was born in July 26, 1946, Gary, Indiana, United States. McCarter died in Jackson, Michigan on April 18, 2023 at the age of 76. His former teammate, Dolph Pudiam, was with him at the time of his death.